Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Razor. So, welcome back to Let's Play Sweet Code 3. In the previous episode, we recruited a bunch of characters. In this episode, we're going to be recruiting more. Also, in the last episode, I forgot to mention that we uh, fought the Churches Falls Ghost Knight in North Cavern. So, we've got more recruits, more people to recruit in this episode, and also, we'll probably be fighting more Churches Falls as well. Uh. We need to head to the mountain path. Or no, we need to head to... I recommend teleport to Claria first. And then from Claria, we want to head to the mountain path. It'll be shorter that way. Alright, so let's go ahead and head down the mountain path here. We might, be, we might be a familiar face from the other Sui Code games, maybe. Probably not. And we got some gold boars here. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and let them go. Even though I kind of need the skill points. But we'll be getting plenty of skill points from the Toad Chest bosses, so. More gold boars, I don't care about them. We're not here to fight gold boars. Hey, look who it is! It's a familiar face from the other two Sui Coden games. It is Fudge, yeah. And so he couldn't want to use with black. And so he couldn't too. We met you recruit him with Humphrey. You gotta have you gotta head to Mount Rocky Tay and all that. I know it's like my own backyard. Yeah, and in Mount Rocky Tower, we saw Bright in Sui Code 2. Well, Bright's all growing up now. And there he is. Yep, Sui Code 1, he had Black. So you could two bright was just a little baby dragon or whatever. Now it's a full grown dragon and so you could three. So yeah, I figure I'd give tell you about so you could one and two because I don't ever plan on I don't ever plan on fully let's playing them games. I did the bosses of so you could two and all that. I'm not gonna do a full let's play of that game. I figured it's been let's played enough. I'm not gonna let's play Sweet Code 1 either. But I will redo the bosses of that game. I kinda did it in the past, but uh, the quality is so bad. I'm gonna redo the bosses of Sweet Code 1 after this game. So he goes all exhausted and all that from the ride. So we gotta look for some girl or something. There she is. Where is she headed? What are you doing, girl? Mm 
me if he is. Sharon. Sharon, I'm so confused. Quite literally. I am confused about what's going on here. Where the hell is she running off to? There she is. Yeah, Millie was in Sui Code 2. I'm not an enemy. We're your allies more than anything. Or we wanna be your we wanna be your allies anyway. Game's got a bunch of weirdos. And Sharon is no excep exception. Punch is pretty cool though. Yeah, <laughs> I know all about that. Not in real life, but you know what I mean. And games, kids, and kid, and get in video games, kids can be very annoying. Yep. Sounds like a plan. We can use all the help we can get. Or Morning ain't gonna beat himself. Puck has joined the 108 stars. Sharon has joined the 108 stars. And you get Bright as well. Bright has joined the 108 stars. Very nice. Alright. So I think that's all the recruits we can get up to this point in the game. So, I'm going to teleport back to town. Or back to. Now I want to teleport to the Tablet of Stars because I'm lazy. I could just run there, but I'm too lazy for that. Go ahead and teleport there. So we got 93 of 108. So I'm going to cut the video here and I'll be right back. Make sure that's all of them. Alright, I'm back and there's no more characters we can recruit at this point in the game. We got all the ones that we can recruit up to this point. You should be at 93. There should be 15 more you're missing. The 15 more that you're missing you'll be able to recruit automatically as you play through the game. So, essentially you have every character up to this point. We got this new hammer here. And now we can buff out a level 15 with the silver hammer that we got last episode. See, I wanna... 
I'm gonna get these characters up to 15 on their weapon. Got Nash here. And I'll be showing off another, a new treasure chest, a new treasure chest ball such as this. Get the main character's weapon up to 15. And I'm going to be using this party for the next uh, main storyline area. That's why I have this party. Yeah, as you can tell, it's costing a lot of money to get your weapons up. So yeah, if you run low on money, just play the lottery. Just do the lottery trick and all that. Alright, I want to get Jax's weapon up. I'm not worried about the other people. Actually, I may get Joker's weapon up too. If I have enough money to. Yeah, the money, it gets ridiculous how much they expect you to make. There we go. Alright, so we'll go and fight the new uh, church chest boss, uh, Nemesis, in uh, uh, Flame Champion Hideaway. So I'll cut the video here and I'll meet you at the church chest boss in the Flame Champion Hideaway. And I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back in. I'm in the flame. I'm in the flame champion hot in the flame champion hideaway, and we got a new enemy here, Copper Sun. We fought the Bronze Suns earlier. Now it's the Copper Sun. Go ahead and auto battle it. Yeah, later in the game, it's actually this thing is actually a terror chest ball. But for now, it's just a regular enemy. There we go, took it down. A lot of EXP for fighting it. So if you want to level up, come here and fight them. Well worth the experience. Alright, so now I'll cut, cut to the terror chest boss, and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back, and up ahead, as you can tell, is the nemesis, the terror chest boss here. Let's go ahead and fight it. Alright, let's go ahead and use True Fire, Final Flame, Rage Room, Final Flame. Uh, yeah, we can use Explosion. So it's for all range attackers in there. Got about 5,100 HP, 5,100 HP. And you see what I did here in my party formation, um, three ranged attackers and three fire mages. That way I can use fire magic without hitting my melee attackers and all that. Yeah, this thing's a pushover. It's got to be way better than that. I'll 
should hear Jax though, but oh well. If he dies, he dies. He's not gonna die because Nemesis is dead, alright. Go and open the chest. Hundred thirty-nine thousand perch. Mega medicine, busted helm, custom cast, uh, wing hat, fine armor, busted chain now, custom tunic, silver white robe, yellow scar, and then a bunch of mega 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 medicines. And there we go. So yeah, I'll end the video here. In the next episode, we will advance the plot finally. And this will be the party I use in the next area of the plot and all that. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode and be sure to check out my other guides and videos on my channel. Please subscribe. Later.